Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we have my bullet journal uh, 2018 flip through and also I will show you my 2019 setup. Um, I've had a few uh, different notebooks in 2018. This is my first one. Um, last year was my first year uh, running a bullet journal um, to be honest it's not really a bullet journal it's a journal uh, a regular journal because i had an idea of my journal last year and reality modified it uh, pretty intensely uh, but you will see um you will see further uh, in the video and okay this is my first notebook i i started this is my witchy like term uh i made it myself um i mean i made this myself uh, this is a traveler's company uh, sticky pouch uh, you can uh, simply put some pictures in here this is a little hole you can slide in a picture I found it pretty useful and all right this was my first one so I had a, I had a rough idea of how I want my bullet journal to look like uh, so I started properly like the rule says I mean to be honest I am very very happy that uh, the main rule of bullet journal is that there is no rules that's why I still call my journal a bullet journal because sometimes I use bullets to uh, to mark some um, important events in my life so here I started of course with with an index, uh, I was not using it at all. Uh, you will see that I have all my pagan holidays in here. I sticked, um, I sticked a calendar. Uh, this year, I decided to do everything myself because I sticked in here so many pieces of paper that its spine broke. That's why I wasn't um, able to use it further, uh, and I had to change it. Uh, but I decided to do everything myself this year, even if it's not going to be perfect, I, I will be happy enough. So I prepared so many trackers. <laughs> this is my... Um, first of all, my journal evolved so much. Like you will see uh, how I decided to get rid of all things I'm not using. I've, I've created so many trackers like uh, mood trackers, mood charts, uh, book tracker, movie tracker, um, movies and TV shows to watch. I was not using it at all, like at all. It was just a waste of space. Uh, this is one of my first spreads. I really, really enjoy it. And this is, uh, this is my poem inspired by Sylvia Plath's Mad Girl's Love Song. This is one of my favorite poets I ever wrote. So I copied it on the typewriter and I sticked it in here. Um, yeah, I had a rough idea, so I decided to use it as a journal. You see, here are a few, a few bullets. They were also evolving, um, but I decided to put everything in here. All my thoughts or or all my ideas. Here was my first meeting with Loa. This is such a great memory. Uh, I really like this journal because I was trying new things and. Yeah, I, I, I loved it. I love doing this. Um, but as you see, it was constantly evolving. Um, I'm not a good painter or a drawer, so I was just printing stuff, mainly from Pinterest or from Creative Market, uh, as I own a few of uh, some very cool graphics. I also, these ones, I got them in Tiger. You can buy some. Mm, some decoupage um, templates and stickers so I decided to use it to my journals I love washi tapes washi tapes are my favorite um, medium so I use them all the time not in here because this was the period I was not having too many now I will I plan to do a washi tape declutter and I will give away all washi tapes I'm not using if you like them so expect the video soon I was using old magazines uh, here. I I have my birthday tracker. It's so lame. Like it's so lame. Uh, 
um, yeah, these are these are um, fragments from the magazines I was buying. I used to buy. I don't buy them anymore because they are expensive, and I read them once and then they just lie around like this. Um, you see, I keep a theme. Of course, everything is very uh, floral, animal inspired, vintage inspired. Here is my favorite, favorite recipe for peanut butter chocolate cookies. If you want it, uh, if you want it, just uh, stop the video and copy it because these cookies. Oh my freaking god, these cookies are wonderful. So uh, I highly recommend checking it out. Mm, all right, I had some uh, some pieces from uh, my shop because I was running a tiktail shop. I was uh, selling some of my stationary bits. I was creating envelopes and letter sets. So these are just things I didn't sell. Let's go. February. Uh, I'm not good in calligraphy. I'm still learning, but <laughs> I just uh, cut out this February. It looks almost like it should be uh, properly written, but yeah, this is also from the magazine. Like these magazines I was using are so cool. Uh, here, uh, here my spreads are starting to have a little bit of a witchy theme because it was the it was the period of time I met my witchy friend and then I decided to uh, to come out uh, as a witch uh, barely to myself because uh, as you may know I I, f I was practicing uh, witchcraft before but I was very afraid to admit it uh, and since then I, I just stopped caring so I decided to use all the motifs uh, this is a fire witch because I consider my, myself as a fire witch uh, so I decided to do themed spreads first the stationary stickers I ordered from, uh, from AliExpress and from other uh, creators here, I don't know, here something went wrong because I decided to do spreads about my favorite book characters, historic characters. Uh, this is of course Tris Marigold from The Witcher, this is my favorite character ever. Uh, here I have a white wolf like Geralt of Rivia spread here. Um, I don't know what happened, I just decided to create them and I didn't care, I just wanted to have them in here, um, I really like this uh, this piece, uh, this flower. I found it on Pinterest, of course. Uh, okay, here we have some tarot cards uh, and these these kind of bullets. I decided to do little um, bullets at the beginning of every note. I love this series of uh, of pictures. I just genuinely love them. I also put them in my new spread, this year's spread. Uh, so I'm going to show you later on. I love old vintage illustrations. Uh, I I just can't. I just can't live without them. So I was printing. I don't know what happened in here. Something just happened. Here, here is my fave royal Marie Antoinette. I love this movie like Kristen Dunst was my favorite favorite Marie Antoinette and I'm going to say it every time to every person who asks and yeah this is the end of my log term because the spine broke and I was so demotivated to continue uh, that I purchased myself a traveler's notebook so now we will uh, now we will have a traveler's notebook flip through I have this uh, binder when I put all my uh, all my inserts I uh, I used through the year so this is the second one yeah th this was the period uh, I was achieving almost these kind of spreads I really wanted to have so I had more washi tapes as you can see this was my favorite one at the moment uh, I was finding more and more graphics I was very happy to 
uh, I was very happy to put in here. Um, yeah, so basically this style of uh, spreads is very consistent nowadays. What do I say? I will just flip through to the next moment I found <laughs> I find a uh, good to comment. This was the period I saw the end of the fucking world. I really enjoyed this TV show. Uh, so I decided to put it on the cover of my third uh, insert I was using. This is one of my favorite spreads ever. As you can see, I purchased some bullet journal uh, sets from Jordan Clark. It was so good, like so good. Here I've seen a Tomb Raider, uh, the movie that came out last year. It was such a shitty movie, like such a shitty movie. I still can't believe I spent money on this. This one is kind of nice too. Um, I planned to see Deadpool 2. I've never seen it. I still haven't seen it. <laughs> so this was a huge fail. This picture was my, and still is, my avatar, and I really, really enjoy it. Um, yeah, I found it also probably on Pinterest. I find everything on Pinterest. Okay, so we have a fourth notebook. Uh, it was a notebook for summer. We have June in here. 
As you can see, there's no more trackers. <laughs> I, I, I stopped it. I, I thought I can't do this anymore. Here uh, are for some stickers from Hello Alice. I, I love her art. I just purchase her stickers as, as often as I can. Oh, that was a great week. We were um, we were at Orange Warsaw Festival. That was my second music festival in life. I had so so much fun, and I've seen Florence and the Machine. I was beyond happy. This washi tape is so good. It's pretty dark, I see on the camera. But the, <laughs> the worst thing about it is that it almost has no glue. So I have to re-glue it every time I want to use it. But it's so beautiful. I really, really enjoy it. I see it's upside down, but well, we can, we can just um, be quiet about that. Here, here I've seen Angus and Julia Stone. Oh my god, what a beautiful evening. This spread, uh, this spread with this Canon sticker is the most popular spread on my Tumblr. Uh, I remember that because I still keep getting notifications that somebody reblogged it. So this is my little success. Social media success, if I can call it. Alright, so now we can go to my traveler's notebook because I still haven't emptied it yet. I will go first through my... I purchased in June, I purchased my uh, weekly calendar. I will uh, guide you through the spreads I've done in here because I found it very convenient. It was um, easier to plan ahead some things. Uh, and I thought it's a really good idea, so I, I was using it.
here we have December. This one, I love this spread so much. Uh, there are a few of Mona's stickers. Mona is my dear friend. She has a super, super cute um, stationery store. I love it. I love it. Her stickers are very beautiful. Okay, so here we have an autumn insert, autumn daily insert. This is the last one. Yeah, and this will be the end of my flip through. So let's go through December. I mean, it's August. Oh my God. August, autumn. Yeah. <laughs> we can see what I was thinking about already in August. Here I have a to buy list. Uh, this is a little spoiler. I haven't buy anything on from this list. Well, also this is the tiniest, the tiniest maple leaf I have ever seen. So cute. This one, this one is um, is a sticker I designed. I painted it. So I had a few of these, but unfortunately I don't have this design anymore. It was lost somewhere on my computer. Um, it was one of the coolest ones and I'm very sad I don't have it anymore. So yeah, this is it for my flip through. And now I will show you my new setup. As you could see in one of my previous journaling videos, this is my new notebook by Archer and Olive. Um, this one is so beautiful. This setup is really, really simple. Uh, I don't have much in here because I decided to just go through uh, as I feel. So I did not put any trackers. I have one tracker maybe. Um, okay, here's my front page. Uh, pretty minimalistic, again with Mona's stickers. I love her witch stickers. I, I really wanted her to do these and she did. Uh, this is a Norse goddess Skadi and these are some protection rules. Some uh, good health and healing rune and this is Kenna's rune, my favorite. And here we have protected by runes since 700. Um, so yeah, this, my, this is my little protection page. Uh, here we have... Uh, here we have a calendar. I've done one totally myself and I'm very impressed because my handwriting is not very neat, but I did it and it looks, um, basically I can see every date I need to see. So I did a really good job. Uh, okay, but I need a calendar so I know what's going on. Here we have a January spread. Uh, I like this one pretty much. It could be better, but it's still very, very nice, I think. I love these stamps. Um, it's very hard to find proper letters because you need to find uh, every letter from a huge pile of letters, very tiny pieces, but I managed to find a January, so I'm very happy about that. I have one tracker as I mentioned. This is January mood tracker. I want to I want to check if I can fill it in. And this is my first page for first two days. Uh, also, I mentioned you will see these uh, illustrations again. I really, really love it. Uh, so yeah, this is everything for my new setup. I don't have much in here. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video and see you in the next one. This one is pretty long, oh my God. Okay, see you in another video, bye.